Hello everyone, this is Lurlian for Ease of Fire World, bringing you a recap of the GSL Season 3, Code S, the semi-finals. The first game of the round of 4 featured two interesting new faces to the later stages of Code S, Prime's Pyun and Incredible Miracle Seed. Pyun began game 1 with an aggressive 3 racks which was able to slow down Seed's expansion, but Seed fought back with a Colossus counterattack that was able to push the Terran up the ramp and kill Pyun's army for a game 1 win. Pyun was able to tie up the series in game 2 with a great Hellion run by that killed 18 probes and secured a macro lead and led to a killing blow. Game 3 was much more slow paced with both players macroing up. Once again Pyun used his Hellions to kill off High Templar and probes and despite Seed's good storms and unit control Pyun's lead was too big and the Terran was able to break the Protoss force and take a game 1 lead. Seed wouldn't give up easily and in game 4 he fought back even after losing more probes to Pyun's Hellions utilizing Dark Templar to buy him time. The prime player's attempt to two base all in was held off effectively and when Seed's third base kicked in it was all over as his massive Pronotos units hit the Terran base for the GG. In the final game Seed was able to render the Banshee ineffective and defend the Terran aggression causing Byun to slowly fall behind. Byun faked getting a third base, pulled SCVs and pushed up Seed's ramp which was looking bad for the Protoss but plus two attack and defense gave him what he needed to just barely fend off the Terran army. Byun noticing he was way behind attempted one last attack pulling SCVs again and engaging but size storms obliterated the Terran causing Byun to GG and Seed to advance to his first GSL finals. In the second match of the round of 4-2 Giants, SKMC and MVP's Don Ray Gu battled for the remaining final spot. In game 1, DRG went for a quick 3 base against MC's Forge fast expand into Stargate. MC went for some Void Ray and Phoenix harassed to some success, but DRG's Queen Control kicked out the aerial units. DRG then scouted MC was going Colossus and attacked with the Roach Infestor Corruptor army, but Great Infestor lifts and a misclick with the Corruptors caused DRG the engagement and the game. Game. game 2 was much more macro oriented with both players getting up to 3 base quickly. DRG once again tried to attack with the Rojuling army but MC's great force fields catch units for easy kills. Eventually MC attacked into Don Regu's spinecrawler wall and his large stalker colossus and immortal force crushed the zerg like a peach on a summer's morning and brought MC's lead to 2-0. DRG began game 3 well with a great defense of MC's sentry drop but during the fight a few zealots were attacking the zerg third base. MC continued to reinforce force at the third utilizing his great micro to maximize damage killing lots of drones and forcing another GG from a distraught looking DRG. At the end of the semi-finals the president Protoss SKMC will move on to the finals to join the innovative Protoss player LGIM Seed in the first PvP GSL finals. That'll do it for the semi-finals of CODES. Don't forget to check us out when we cover the grand finals. For more coverage and news around esports, find us on Twitter at ESFI and on the web at ESFIWorld.com. Until next time, this was Lurlian for ESFI World.